so this is what we do on a pickup day or an egg retrieval day. When we receive your sperm sample in the red cup, we would look at we would then look at the sperm sample on the microscope. After that, we will then layer it through density lab and um, density gradient centrifugation. And with the density gradient centrifugation, it will then separate the seminal plasma and everything that we do not want from the sperm sample from the progressively motile sperm. And that's exactly what we want at the end of the day. All right, so what I'm gonna do now is I'm just gonna layer the density gradient centrifugation. This ensures that the sperm goes through two density layers and each layer will then separate a different particle from what we want from the sperm pivot. transfer the semen into the tubes it will be double witnessed by another immunologist so this sample has already been witnessed so I can continue before we add it to the tube there's other parameters that we need to look at so we measure the volume of the sperm sample we then check the viscosity of the sperm sample and if we're happy with all that we will add the sperm to the gradients. The sperm is added. After this, we will pop it into the centrifuge and centrifuge it. Sperm separation technique. So, as you can see here, this is, was our first density gradient. You can see the layers of how this uh, semen was separated, and this is exactly what we want. So, we want the little pellet there at the bottom, and that's what I'm going to take now to put into our next tube. So, I'm just going to aspirate the top seminal fluid here. That. And then we reach down. Into the washing area. So then we put it in the centrifuge again. the semen preparation on the day. As you can see here, this is our final spin. It's much cleaner than the first one. And what we want is the pellet there at the bottom. That is the sperm that we will use to inseminate the eggs with. We will count the final product, uh, product that we have. Okay, and now this bin is ready for us to use.